Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. As we all know that Hammer is a standard standoff missile for a file fighter jets with Indian Air Force. Indian Air Force had acquired the first lot of these hammers for a file fighter jets at the time when aircraft had started coming to the Air Force from France to further enhance the air to ground targeting capabilities of its most advanced fighter jet. Now, what was not clear that the number of hammer missile ordered, as per latest presentation shared by Safran while they were in India for opening MRO facility in Hyderabad and Bengaluru, it was revealed that Safran has already supplied 200 plus hammer missile to Indian Air Force. Last year, Air Force has also placed additional order for hammer missile for light combat aircraft LCA Tejas, which would allow it to take out hardened bunkers or ground targets at long standoff ranges of more than 70 km. The capability enhancement of LCA Tejas fighter aircraft was done in the middle of a military standoff with China using emergency procurement power granted by Narendra Modi government to the defense forces. Due to the urgency at that time in the view of Chinese aggression, the French authorities have also agreed to supply them at a short notice. Now, as per latest update, HL has already successfully completed the integration of Hammer missile with Tejas. Now, next is the test. The test of Hammer will soon be followed by that of the Joint Direct Attack Munition JDAM, around 250 of which were recently ordered by Indian Air Force and we have reported. And the DRDO's smart anti-airfield weapon SAW. The integration of hammer missile on Tejas will provide capability to carry out Balakot type airstrike. Hammer or highly agile modular munition extended range is a medium range air to ground weapon. It was initially designed and manufactured for the French Air Force and Navy. The missile has two versions which has been categorized based on type of guidance system used in it. First version has hybrid inertial or GPS in decameter all weather version and second version has hybrid inertial GPS and infrared homing or SALH in metric day or night version. It can carry 250 kg of warhead. Hammers would give India the capability to take out any bunkers or hardened shelters in any type of terrain including mountainous locations such as in eastern Ladakh. The Indian Air Force is strongly supporting the indigenous LCA Tejas fighter aircraft program by adding more and more capabilities like hammer and saw. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.